welcome to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to teach you and you are going to learn how to create a apple or how to create an apple in inkscape this is very easy to do and if you pay attention you will create an apple within no time and um, watch my other videos uh, to see how I create different things when you continue watching my videos you will be able to open an Etsy SVG shop within let's say within no times because all the things I've been teaching here are uh, catering to opening a shop because a shop or SVG shop has helped me change my life so I want to help you guys also to draw stuff to create some SVG files and to make money on Etsy okay let's get started the first thing we're going to do we're going to save our file go to file save as I save my file in the libraries of my computer, the picture library, and I'll name it How to Draw an Apple. And I'll save it as a plain SVG. Okay, save. And you see the name changed. Okay, the first thing we're going to do, we're going to use the BCA tool. Click on the BCA tool. Draw this line. Let me show you something. Let's do it again. You click, you drag it, you left click, oh no, click, drag it, left click, and then right click. Let's do it again. Click, drag it left click and right click and then you have your line let's delete this one let's delete this one okay now we're going to work with this one and now you go to the node editor and then we're going to move our line hold and drag you see that we're going to create an apple yeah and then pull this over here if you want to you can move this a little bit in and then take this a little bit up okay mm -hmm. let me bring it in here okay now we have this we're going to duplicate it by pressing Ctrl D. And then we're going to flip it with uh, the letter H. Flip it. Okay, and then I'll hold and I'll drag it. I'll drag it to here. I'm going to check if it's closed. Yep, it's closed. I'll zoom out with my minus. Zoom out with my minus. And I'll check the bottom part. Okay, it's also closed. Okay, and I'll zoom out and I'll go to my bucket, my list. Not my bucket list, well, my paint bucket. And I'll go and I'll stand here and I'll color it. You see that? And then I, I'll, I'll remove it from it. Then I'll delete this. Delete all this. Okay. Here's my apple body. Now I'm going to make the tiny stem and a leaf over here. I'll go back to my BCA tool. And I'll create a triangle. I'll create this small triangle. I'm going to duplicate this triangle by pressing Ctrl plus D again. Now move this aside. Editor. Move this aside. Okay. 
I'll go to my node editor and I pull this down and I pull this here and then here let's do it again hold and drag it down I move this to this side move this a little bit down there you have it okay I'll deselect it don't select it deselect it go to your paint pocket and then let me see number let me see this brown and then I'll color it brown and then I'll go back to my cursor and then I'll remove it and I'll delete this delete this and then I'll bring this over to my apple cast mode I'll undo it right here my apple and this I'm going to use this for the leaf I'll go back to my node editor let's zoom in with number three and then I'll pull this over here over here and then I'll bring this a little bit down actually I'll delete I'll, I'll select it with node editor and I'll delete it okay and then I'll make a cute leaf Move these handles. Bring this a little bit down. Yeah. Okay, I love this leaf. Now go back to I'll go back to the paint bucket. I'll take uh, the green here. No, that's wrong. Undo. This shouldn't be selected. I need to. Okay, I'll go to the paint bucket. I'll get no, the green and I'll stand inside and I'll paint it color it and then I can remove it then I can delete this okay my app I'll rotate it make it a little bigger let's see maybe I can make this a little bigger too okay I'll flip this and then I'll Turn it and I'll edit here, and we have our apple. Select all and I'll group all and I'll save it by pressing Ctrl plus S. And this is how we draw an apple in Inkscape. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and to press on the bell so that uh, when I have uh, uploaded new. Um, tutorials so that you will be notified and so that you will know thank you so much for watching see you next week bye